So guys yes another great news this one is double blessing the twitter is blowing off in nigeria currently apparently david and choma have reportedly welcomed a set of twins we do not know if uh if it's girls or boys but set of twins you guys know David Do and Choma's story now. You do not know anybody to tell you. Well, this is double, double, double blessing. Double, double blessing. And uh, it was confirmed by David Do's elder brother. Well, the Twitter in Niger currently, Twitter space in Niger currently is blowing off. Well, firstly, big congratulations to David Do and Choma. I don't want to say apparently again because... This is definitely true. I heard it from a confirmed source, and I cannot reveal that source. He said yesterday, David Do and Choma welcome set of twins. Set of twins, double blessings. If you guys recall, as at last year, 2022, November 1st, David Do and Choma had one of the worst news in 2022 when they traveled out of uh, lagos to attend the function it was reported that david o's son if i drowned in his mansion in banana island the mansion he recently bought as a den what about a few billions of naras that his son drowned in his own mansion david o was devastated and david o evil went home going for months without talking to anyone and just to confirm this news as well as at 9 o6 p.m 10th 8 20 2023 david do tweeted that this week will be the best week well of course like i've said before you guys recall 2022 when he finally died and i may so continue to rest in paradise and just to feel that closure again from Choma after the old scrutiny, the old disgrace from my side cheeks and here and there, Choma decided to stay really, really calm. Really, really calm out of limelight. Nurturing herself. And people thought she was kind of like uh, sad about the whole situation. Of course, she was sad as a mother. She lost a really uh, close thing close to her heart. So she should be sad. But she went out of the limelight, tried to get her sanity. And of course, David O did the job well, get her pregnant again. And uh, now they just welcome a set of twins. I'm so, so happy for them, considering the public scrutiny considering the lies the truth also considering a lot of bunch of stories online man these celebrities are actually really really trying to considering the stories online then that can even drive someone insane there was even instances people were already insinuating that david o may have uh, may have sacrificed his son for illuminati for his music uh career to boom you know all those sorts of allegations you know crazy and uh, again someone getting arrested the housemate and so many other stories as well but that story that death of ifying really changed their life really changed their mindset about parenting and i pray and i hope god has given them another opportunity to bring in another life and uh, they should better start making use of it well better start making use of it use of it well and make sure they take care of these ones nothing should happen to this uh, uh these babies again you know nothing if i passed away may that boy so continue to rest in paradise and now god has come for just imagine dropping one of the biggest album in africa currently and also welcoming twins into the world just imagine that kind of blessing going on tour making so much money and also god bless you with a set of twins although there are so many side talk again now so many side talk allegations and everything eh? but what we are talking about is a set of twins forget about the side talk forget about oh maybe it says um choma underwent surrogacy choma did this and did that 
It was uh, a factory made babies. Well, it's God that gives children. If, even if you put a, a factory made baby inside your stomach or a surrogacy or inside a bottle, if God said he's not going to blow life into those kids, into any, any child, he's not going to do it. So children are children, whether factory made, whether anything made. Kids, children are children. It's God that blesses people with kids. So that ideology that, oh, is something that went to doctors, surrogacy, and all those things. Please remove that mentality from your head. It's God that gives kids. And if God refuses to give you children, there is nothing you can do. There is no doctor. There are, there are people who have spent billions on trying to get children. But yet, they can't. It's not something that you can just go and get. It's a divine blessing from God. So forget about the side talk. Forget talk coming from a chemical lawyer that I'm going to share with you now to tell you exactly what she said, the story and everything she said. Well, I think I should touch that now. According to online journalist chemical lawyer, she said, breaking exclusive only on Kemi talk. She said, after years of anxiety and depression, after losing an only child and unable to conceive, while dealing with uh, mental health issues, stray side chicks and DVD drama, Choma Adelike went through a successful fighter fertility treatment and delivered twins. Reportedly at Grandy Hospital, a prominent Atlanta, Georgia teaching hospital last night. The Adelikes welcomed a boy and a girl. <laughs> They welcome a boy and a girl, but Kemi should take it really, really easy now. How can she go so low on the uh, David Do and Cho and, uh, and uh, Choma saying all sorts of uh, stuff? Well, she continues. She said, "Obio Junior too and uh, Choma Junior uh, love weigh in at approximate five pounds each. Wow, very healthy. Uh, Choma has been on bed rest for the past ninety days." The babies were born by Chesari, uh, sorry, a uh, C-section at uh, 38 weeks. David O wasn't planning to announce yet. I've made it official. Well, I do not think Kemio actually know what is she's saying. I think uh, it's uh, David O's elder brother that even wrote something on uh, his uh, Twitter or Ando. And made people really, really believe that David Doe was David Doe and Choma actually welcome uh, a set of twins. But but Kemi need to really, really stop with the allegations, man. You know, and uh, I like the way Choma is really quiet. Too, you know, just stay quiet. Don't allow anybody to know about these things. Not to put on a uh, put put some negative thought in your head. You know. Stay away from media, stay away from social media, from Twitter, all social media platform. Not to start seeing it, all those rubbish. Take care of your kids and, and take them away very far away from the video social media. Tell the video not to be posting his, 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 uh, your set of twins on social media because the other time if I in uh, die, we don't know exactly what happened to if I. So she should be very, very protective of this uh, set of twins. And uh, Kemi, you, you you're using expression like depression, anxieties, and everything. That was really, really cool. Though. Well, trauma need to protect herself. Protect herself, protect your kids. And uh, do not allow any owl maid to take care of your children when you are not around. God has given you, given her the opportunity again. Like I said before, kids are not easy to get. You think it's easy, then go and try it to see how hard it is. People are looking for children for years. They have all the millions, all the billions in the world to pay doctors, and yet it's difficult for them to have kids. So it's only God that gives children. Eh? It's only God. And if God said you won't have none, you won't have it. No matter the doctor, no matter the fertility hospital you go to, you won't. But thank God that trauma and every other baby mother out there who are currently looking for, for children, I pray for you and I hope God blesses you one day with uh, kids abundantly and uh, your heart desires as well.
I'm so so happy for them and uh, big big congrats to David Do and Choma and uh, and their entire family as well. This is a team of joy and uh, they should celebrate.